Welcome back to Underwater Math. I'm your teacher, Sir Puffington. Your class is just arriving at Fish Academy. Our class today is all about solving one-step addition and subtraction word problems. Good morning, Sir Puffington. Good morning, Stella. Earl, nice to see you. Thomas, always a pleasure. And Oliver, glad to have you back. All right, everyone, find your places, please. Class is about to begin. As I mentioned, class today is about solving one-step addition and subtraction word problems. Let's start with addition problems. Yes. I love word problems. I'm glad to hear that, Thomas. Let's dive straight into our first problem. Ray blew 432 bubbles this morning and 245 bubbles this afternoon. How many bubbles did Ray blow in all? When working with word problems, we want to consider the important information. What pieces of this problem seemed important? I think the numbers are important. 432 bubbles and 245 bubbles. Absolutely, Earl. The numbers are critical to solving this problem. I would underline them to signify their importance. I think the words in all are important. That tells me I need to add. Nicely done, Oliver. Yes, the words in all tell us we need to add. Let's add together 432 and 245. I'll stack them first. 2 plus 5 equals 7, 3 plus 4 equals 7, and 4 plus 2 equals 6. Ray blew 677 bubbles in all. Time for a brain break. Everybody dance. Let's dive straight into our first subtraction problem. Ray ate 294 tacos this morning and 146 tacos this afternoon. What is the difference in the number of tacos Ray ate this morning and this afternoon? When working with word problems, we want to consider the important information. What pieces of this problem seem important? I think the numbers are important. 294 and 146. Absolutely, Earl. The numbers are critical to solving this problem. I will underline them to signify their importance. I think the word difference is important. It tells me I need to subtract. Nicely done, Oliver. Yes, the word difference is the answer to a subtraction problem. Let's subtract 146 from 294. I'll stack them first, putting the smaller number on the bottom. We can't take 6 away from 4, so we need to borrow from the 10's place. I'll cross out 9, turn it into an 8, and bring one set of 10 over to the 1's. Now I have 14 minus 6, which is 8. In the next place value we have 8 minus 4, which is 4. In the 100's we have 2 minus 1, which is 1. The difference in the amount of tacos Ray Ed is 148 tacos. Great work. Nicely done class. You are ready to practice on your own. Have a great day.